Hello everyone, welcome to back my channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before starting the video, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Tori Roloff, a member of Little People, speaks candidly in a new video about her marital issues with husband Zach and her feelings of exhaustion. People, Big World Show airing the following week. The video shows Tori and 32-year-old Zach Roloff relaxing on their terrace and talking about their relationship. The TLC star laughs and says to his wife, You don't yell that often but, to which she snaps, I don't yell ever. Zach smugly says, Oh, I wouldn't say ever, as he rocks in his chair. You don't give me any credit for anything, an irate Tori snarls. The 32-year-old tries to counter that he does acknowledge her, but Tori is unwavering in her position, saying, You do not, though. As a horrified Zach turns to the camera, the mother of three confesses, This is an issue in our marriage right now. Tori goes on, I'm worn out. Everyone wants something from me, therefore I'm practically pouring from an empty cup. Tori informs her husband, You're sleeping upstairs tonight. As the video then cuts back to the Roloff's backyard, the LPBW broadcast on Tuesday also featured the reunion of Matt Roloff, 61, with his son Zach and daughter-in-law Tori. The patriarch and the spouse did not get along when he put a portion of the family farm up for sale to outsiders. On contrast to Zach's earlier statement that his relationship with his father would never be the same, Matt was shown making amends in this week's episode of Little People. In Washington, where Zach and Tori now reside with their three children, he made his way. Matt visited Zach to see the work he had been doing on his acreage and to see the new baby Joja. He asked Tori if he might hold the baby because he seemed so happy to see his new grandchild. As the mother of three remarked, we just wanted grandpa, we needed you to come over, the infant grinned in Matt's arms. Zach, meanwhile, stepped back and smiled awkwardly. The bridge Zach was constructing on his property did, however, seem to bring the father and son closer together. He's built a lot of bridges himself over the years, so I know he's interested in something like this. I know he's into bridges, said Zach in a private moment. Matt exuded pride in his son's efforts to establish a legacy by starting his own farm. He said, in this case, Zach is experiencing the joy of project ownership. I'm glad Zach is creating his own memories because they are very similar to the childhood memories he had. I believe he is acting them out. Zach, though, had no intention of taking charge of everything himself in Washington. He and his 32-year-old twin brother Jeremy previously attempted to negotiate with their father to buy a 16-acre parcel of Roloff Farms, the Oregon family farm where they grew up. The sons and Matt were unable to come to an agreement, so Matt listed the plot for $4 million. Zach and Tori first separated Matt's girlfriend Karen Chandler from the infant Josia during the conflict. As Zach accused his father of trying to make money off his own family, the two spouses appeared to be at a standstill. However, they eventually met at the national meeting of the Little People of America, where Karen finally got to know Josia. Matt was still unable to sell his $4 million listing despite the severe family repercussions. Since then, he has made the decision to turn the home into an Airbnb. The U.S. Sun announced in November that Karen would not appear in the upcoming season of Little People. The program premieres new episodes every Tuesday at 9 o'clock p.m. Eastern Standard Time on TLC.